This featherweight bout is brought to you by Dream Machines Motorsports, the home of the best new and used ATVs and motorcycles in Kansas City. Fighting out of the blue corner from Springfield, Missouri, Billy the Kid Wilson! Fighting out of the red corner from Kansas City, Missouri, Devontae Frencher! Make some noise! The bell in round number one. Both fighters immediately running to the center of the cage. Black and white trunks for Billy Wilson. Black, gray, and gold trunks for Devontae Frencher. Tonight's fight clock is presented by Hoy Excavating. Looking to pounce now, entry with the left hand is Billy Wilson. Frencher right back to his feet. Clever turn along the fence. Uppercut to the body from Devontae Frencher, the turn right back from Billy Wilson. I like what Billy Wilson's doing right now. He's controlling the upper half of Frencher's body, but he's also attacking with his legs, trying to off-balance Frencher. It's very, very smart, and it can open up more possibilities for the takedown like that. Nicely done on the outside trip. Good, heavy pressure by Wilson. Half butterfly now for Devontae Frencher. Frencher needs to get his back up against the cage to stand up. The most athletic position you can be is when your feet are gonna be flat on the ground. Right now, his feet are not in an athletic position because they're in the air. Big shots from Billy Wilson. Jackhammer left hand. Frencher trying to get back to his feet, sucking in that near side leg. Now looking for the far side ankle pick is Billy Wilson. Collapsing the leg. Well done by Wilson, staying very tight. You see, bringing Frencher's knees together. That lace up right there that he, Billy Wilson has is very intelligent to keep an off balance fighter from standing up. And uh, he goes right back to it. It's a Khabib style. The one thing that would make this more powerful is if he's able to reach around and cuff his hand like he's going for, for that Dagestanian handcuff. From the triangle position, short right hand. Frencher needs to work on getting his knees free. See how now he got to the ground. He needs to work on shooting right back up. Wilson now looking rear naked choke. You see Frencher trying to explode back to his feet. It's beautiful display by Frencher to get back to his feet, but it's even better that Wilson right now is still controlling the upper body of Frencher and attacking the legs to keep him off balance and concerned on what's gonna happen next. Great start to this fight for Billy Wilson, staying very tight on Devontae Frencher. Frencher has just simply had no time, no space to find his offense. Looking belly to back suplex, couldn't fully hit it, but Wilson still taking the top position after a slight scramble on the ground. Closing stages round number one, 15 seconds remaining in this opening round. This is a really technical fight from both guys here. From the stand-up of Frencher and the takedown and the relentless pressure that Wilson's giving out, what a, an impressive round for both of these fighters. Short knee just before the bell. Next stop, round two. One thing about wrestling is it is taxing on both guys right here. So this fight right now, both of them are looking strong. Both of them are looking ready. And I feel like cardio is going to be coming into play. Let's see what their corner is going to say to them on the stand up to initiate before this wrestling sequence that happens. James Krause telling Devontae Frencher, breathe, relax. If you're in Wilson's corner, what are you saying to your fighter? Wilson, an extremely strong round. I think they're telling him, keep up the intensity. 
don't take your foot off the proverbial gas pedal. You have to continue with that heavy pressure, continue to have that smothering pace on Devontae Frencher. I love it. Either that or come on, you're doing great, you're winning. Hyping the fighter up is the best thing you can do between rounds. I mean, we've seen it with Mike Perry and his girlfriend. She hypes him up the whole time. So right here might be what they need, but. There are two, definitely two schools of thought, Julian, on cornering. Either be a cheerleader or be a tactician. Ooh, beautiful body shot right there by Frencher. I like that. Ooh. I kick just missed. Wilson didn't even flinch, never took a backward step. Now he takes a forward step, driving Frencher's back against the fence. I like how Frencher is not just staying flat against the wall. He's moving side to side on the cage. That doesn't allow Wilson to be able to use his legs or use his grips to control Frencher. Outside kick from Billy Wilson. Frencher trying to work his way back into this fight. Big swing and a miss with the right hand by Frencher. Allows the turn for Wilson on the inside. Two minutes remaining round number two. See right here, Wilson's controlling, controlling the posture, but Frencher is moving his feet. That right there is the key on the cage to get off as you have to move feet. A beautiful takedown by Wilson right there. Gorgeous, committing to that takedown. Turned into a low single on the shot. Now looking for the outside trip is Billy Wilson. Wilson bringing the knees together, getting that takedown. Wilson's really sticky with his pressure. He is, and you know what? He's going for control. He's not looking for damage right here. He's looking to control the fighter. He's sitting there using his, his legs as hooks, using the leverage points of Frencher to take it away from keeping his balance there. And he's landing this ground and pound with position before. Left hands from Wilson, looking to open up the chin of Devontae Frencher. Frencher doing well to get back to his feet as he kept his chin tucked. Frencher's doing a good job of controlling the hands, but we need him to move. There you go, moving his, his butt off the cage right there. On the teep from Wilson, again coming forward. We got an open stance from both guys, so the, the, the left hand or the right hand, the power shots are gonna be the ones that land first. You don't wanna throw the jabs. Outside kick. Ooh, ooh. Big swings, wide swings from Frencher. That backs off Billy Wilson, although neither fully landed. Half kick from Wilson in return. 30 seconds remaining round two. Again, looking for the collapse on the double. With the dump and he hits it. You see again the control bringing the knees together. That's that sticky pressure from Wilson. It's, it's very smart, man. It's very, very smart in a technical fight that he's having here. Once he gets to the cage, he's looking to take it down and take the levers and take the power and making Frencher unathletic at this point. Strong stuff thus far from Billy Wilson as we move to the third and final round. This fight right here is a, a beautiful display. Wilson's doing a great job at using his hands to dive in for that takedown. And now that we know that we've seen the same combination before that uh, shot, it's an, uh, a lead hook into a diving double leg. I wonder what Frencher's corner is telling him, hey, this is the same shot he's taken. This is what I want you to do. Stop backing straight up towards the cage. I want you to circle off as he pressures you in. But I mean, the, this stuff, these boys are strong. These boys have a lot of power. They both respect each other's hands. So anything can change, as we've seen in the past couple of fights. Anything can change in the moment of a second. Dante Frencher exploding off of his stool. One would have to think he's down two rounds to none, 2018. Yeah, both these boys still showing energy right now in the third round. They're ready for it. Third and final round. We'll see if Devontae Frencher noticeably turns up the temperature here to start round number three. Wilson on the entry, he's done this very well, driving Frencher back against the fence. Frencher just has not had a lot of time and space, Julian, in this fight. No, he hasn't. He, he's, he's waiting too much, almost like he's trying to counter from Wilson, and instead of just attacking, see how he's shadow boxing in front of him? You know, I would like for him to throw his punch and commit. You know, every time he commits, he lands. 
But as you see right there, when you evade and you're backing up, it's easy to get taken down. And Wilson back on that sticky style takedown we were talking about earlier. Now walking up the hips of Frencher is Billy Wilson walking up the back. See the hand fighting on the inside. Wilson looking to get one standing hook in. Allows Frencher space to turn. Frencher trying to throw back with the left hand. Knee to the body, there's the separation. Frencher now pulling this fight back to the center of the cage off of the jab. Frencher needs to go for broke right now. We're, you know, halfway through the round, almost halfway through the round. He needs to get this, that pick up the action. He can't go back to the ground. He has to keep fighting up. And he's doing a good job of it right now, you know. Billy Wilson is not, not giving him any space. He's being relentless with the pressure. He's being relentless with the takedowns. He's switching it up, being, you know, a very different takedown every time. He went for an inside trip right there. He just stepped his foot on the outside for the outside trip. He's fighting the hands. He's switching up, throwing the knees. He's doing a great job to keep Frencher guessing on the cage. Frencher looking for space, looking to turn off. And again, on that low shot, bringing the legs together, it's the control of the knees and the hips that ultimately, right now, I believe is winning this fight for Billy Wilson. Frencher just no answer defensively to those takedown attempts. On the chest hold from the back, more control, 45 seconds remaining in this fight. The amount of energy it costs to stand up after getting taken down over and over again is an enormous and Frencher is still putting up a fight against Wilson and Wilson is getting frustrated as you can see to like what do I need to do next to keep this guy down on the ground another level change another big dump takedown for Billy Wilson oh he's got that in pretty tight that would be a remarkable come from behind victory. It would be, but he's got it tight. He needs to turn his hips a little bit more. You can see it's on the ear, not fully on the neck. The bell, the end of the fight. What a great tactical fight by Billy Wilson on there. Every time he was on the cage, he was mixing up the takedowns, using different types of posts, using different types of picks and pulls that kept uh, Frencher frustrated. But Frencher, a great job by just not giving up and being relentless. Let's look at the Major Mac Pack replay. Right here, Wilson on that double A, locking his hands, lifting up, gets the slam, immediately steps over the legs to lace it in and locks it in. See how he figure fours right there? That's keeping Frencher's legs off the ground and keeping him in an unathletic position. As he sits there, beautiful, beautiful display, beautiful display of wrestling against the cage. Congratulations, Billy Wilson. I think he ultimately got this victory. It's difficult to see it going any other way. Three Missouri Athletic Commission judges scorecards being tallied right now. The the energy and the cardio that Frencher showed is unbelievable. It doesn't even look like he's sweating right now. It was like a walk through the park for him. But, you know, he, he learned a lot in this fight. He's going to get better. And what an amazing display. Let's give it up one more time, ladies and gentlemen, for these fighters going the distance. Judge Carey scores about 30 to 27. Judge Marquez scores about 30 to 27. And Judge Munoz scores about 30 to 27. Your winner, by unanimous decision, out of the blue corner, Billy the Kid Wilson! First class performance from Billy Wilson with the takedowns, with the position, with the control. The winner, by way of unanimous decision, Billy Wilson defeats Devontae Frencher.